Danielson! Let's turn the truck around. Seeing if I can get lucky and leave my climbing gear on. I think I can. <laughs> yeah, I think I can. Yeah. <laughs> Just gonna creep one. Woo! First gear. This, uh, this 66 is a nice power saw. It's crazy. It's crazy, man. See that flick? This axe just flicks it. That went out into the past. Right. Yeah, 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 yeah. In that was between the little shelters. How long you had that on your arm there? Oh, 20 forever. years? Um, oh, nice. It's my dog. Yeah. yeah. My what was his name? That was Emily. And then my greyhounds, Rebel Bob. And nice. So you're good stripping that little guy, buddy? Yeah, I'll just chuck it out. So, Wait, so which, go where is that one going to go? Well, I'll just climb it and we'll do the similar order to it. You can actually leave that hooked up, Dad. Oh, no, because uh, I may do this. Si well, I might even just chunk that out. Yeah. It's so small. It'll be quicker. And you don't so, so, Dad, if you want to go after the ropes, yeah. awesome. What's that, son? I don't think you'll really need to do much rigging there, maybe in the top. Yeah. Pick up. Okay, you can throw in one there. Beauty. Hey, is that a 
tree climber over there? Skinny tree, skinny guy. Yeah. Balsams are brutal for that. and the apple tree. Your, you know what I'm saying, friends. There we go. Back to the picks. It's skinny little tree, friends. So, actually, you know what I just noticed? I just looked down and I saw something, this thing. I don't like those like that, hanging like that. Stuff can get hooked in there and yard on you hard. So, um, I just saw that. I'm just gonna clean that up real quick. The rigging and it hangs off back there somewhere. Maybe off of that carabiner. Okay, that way it breaks and doesn't stick and peel out. The sap's running, that's no fun. So as we get up smaller, we're in eight inches of wood now, it starts to get a little bit gravity starts to get weird on you so these so you leave these you see this is these stubs i was telling you about leave these friends leave them look at me it, without this thing right now i would feel very unstable okay so and it looks to me we got to go quite a ways yet so you know what i'm saying just just leave this these things for yourself <laughs> That's what happens. So these little guys right now literally are my best friends. 
these little stubs. They are 100% my best friend because the tree's not growing straight up. So your strap wants to roll down and out. Do you understand? It wants to keep sliding back at you. So yeah, these little stubs, they come in real handy because we're not done. We're like we're, we're not done. We got to go a ways up here. So do you know what I'm saying friends? Boom. Okay. Now we got wind blowing right on the house. See? Now So this can peel down and out because it'll stick to the tree. This is birch. It will literally stick to the tree. But what it might do is grab the bark, you see, and pull my strap. So if I go like this, it won't go anywhere. Again, these stubs, they make it fun. Like it's blowing, actually, friends. It's literally blowing on the house. This is gonna be a rigging show, 100%. 100%. This I could probably hang, just peel and hang, I reckon. Let's give it a shot. It, it is blowing and it is getting skinny. hold the butt look at that look at this you see that's birch it literally is cr look at that it didn't even peel out like this stuff's nuts so there we go what if i shan't rig that boy no i could just keep climbing and i may as well just do what i've always done See, look at these things. Look at these. <laughs> We're in five inches of wood now, and it's starting to move around real good. So, th without these, not fun. Like, not fun at all. See? Now, strap around nub, boom, bang, go. Right? Pick them up. I'm in five inches of wood now. I could probably let this go, you see. I think what I'm gonna do, because I'm I'm in small enough wood now, I could literally either get on the back side of this thing or I could fit that. That'll fit! Won't it? Yeah. It would be nice to be on the other side of the tree right now because the house is behind me, but that stuff's not gonna happen. I'm just gonna reposition here. Stand on my little nub that I left. 
and get into position. Kick back on my strap just a little bit. So I got room for power saws. See me here? It's blowing on the house, okay? So there's no point in me taking that limb off because then it's gonna de-weight the stem more for there. So that is not the plan, okay? This is the plan right here. I don't need to rig this thing, there's room. I've come high enough, but I will tell you this. I think it's time to notch these sides. <laughs> Right dead square on path, okay? So there's the holding wood. The, wood the, the house is behind me, you see? So I left my holding wood high off the house to keep this off the house, even though I notched my sides. I kept a little strip in the middle, keeping it high. Okay, friends, so here's, here's the deal on, on these stubs again, okay? I'm just, I'm talking about a broken record guy right now. I'm way up there. Like I'm, I'm way up. Look, look at the stem under me. She's wobbling, turning like a noodle, okay? But strong, like really strong wood. So without the stubs, without these stubs, if you slipped in it and it, you had a little Watusi, guess what? Your strap grabs onto a stub and you go hanging. That's it, that's the only thing that can happen to you. See? So leave them, friends. I've said it so many times on this climb because I'm, I'm so happy that I left them. Go. Here we go. So what I'm gonna do here is, this wood will move itself. I almost feel like taking a bigger chunk. Right, friends? Okay. Oh. Oh. Flat as a pancake. All right. Now we do a little jimmy, jimmying down here. You slip and take out your scrotum on one of those too. You got to watch it. You don't want your scrotum gone. You need that. Especially if you're Nick Pixel. Because he's got to make babies. So Nick, be careful. Watch your stubs. What's that, buddy? Watch your stubs. Watch your stubs, man. They, they can be your best friend or your worst enemy. That I know. So we got to go back this way, friends. So that, that's what I'm talking about, weight distribution, right? And you don't want greenery down by your feet. That's not what you want. Get rid of that if possible. You can't see what's going on. There we go. Okay. So this one, believe it or not, is kind of funky. The weight distribution, like I talked about, gets situated. I'm going to use this stem to kind of pull it over a bit. Okay, but I'm not cutting this one off yet because I'm going to use it. So I'm going to go just above here. Get comfortable. Let's see if we can do this. But I'll show you another little trick. Okay, see that? 
out here nice and deep. So now you're over center line. See, now we created a big notch in there, okay? Let's do this. Okay, so friend, these are all old school techniques, okay? This isn't for everybody, but it's for the old school guy. That was leaning back there, so I went deep to get it to cave in on itself. Go deep! great big huge undercut now it's it's past its center point so it's gonna it's gonna sit down on itself we got a judgment we can't have it I'm showing you this just so you can see what's going on. Look at that undercut. Look at it. Okay? Look. This wood is so tough. Most woods will do this. But what you want to make sure at this point is this doesn't... You, you want to open this up here, friends. You don't want to leave... You don't want that closing right now. So you're almost better to just clean this out because this is going to hit. It's almost like a Dutchman. That is a Dutchman right there. So watch what we're doing here. Okay? Like this. Look at, see that? I opened up this here. So now it's just gonna travel and blast off. But I will cut it off. I just need to get it moving. I don't need hinge wood once she's to the point of no return. I need that hinge wood for direction. Check it out. There's our piece. Look it. That's it. Okay, friends. So you 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 have you have friends up here. I call them friends. You 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 have friends like holding wood, stubs. We didn't rig anything here. I want that axe? Oh, that was so close. Oh, we're gonna get it. One more. Just give her, boy. <laughs> what does that tell you about some wood? Okay. So that's got to tell you a little something about fiber on birch trees. Look at this, friends. This isn't as deep as I wanted to go, but look at it. My bar's bent. 
I felt it on the topping saw, it's bent, it was carving off, which makes sense. <laughs> so there we are, friends. There's about two inches of holding wood at the very back to the center. All right, so here we go. What I'll do is I'll just nick the corner over there. I think I'll clean that undercut up a bit too. Look at the spruce tree. We're not cutting up. No, it's our little saving grace, that little spruce. <laughs> I know it's gonna be my Christmas tree. Let's leave it. <laughs> At some point. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, I'll probably run that big bar. You got, is that doll, that doll bar okay, boy? Yeah, it's got a 28 inch bar. I don't know how much you like that. Hey, I got an idea. Let's leave that thing like that. Because it'll, it'll little, little, little things will come off it. Yes. Yeah, Let's leave the little stub like that beside that little Christmas tree. It looks really cool, okay? <laughs> <laughs> You'll get lots of birds and it'll Let's do it. Yeah. Because you know what? I can cut that down. I don't feel then like I've really killed it. You see, Billy Ray has a heart as big as all outdoors. <laughs> He's always thinking, you know. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> that that's quite the topping you've done. There. Yes, it's a, a polard they call it. <laughs> a, a polard. Hey, you got that beautiful be beach in the back. Yeah, not oh. from one step. Sorry, friends. So we're leaving this just like that, like a little wildlife zone on on Tofino's west coast. Look at that, friends. Isn't that beautiful? I'm very excited about it. And that birch is going to grow. You guarantee it. So so that's nifty. Because I could see she was a bit sad. She's going to say hi to you guys on YouTube. See her sad face. Yes. It's a bit sad to kill us. It, it, is, it, is it Cindy? Everyone always it's Lisa. Lisa. It's Lisa. See, Lisa, Cindy. That's a, ah. I called you Cindy before, didn't I, too? It's Lisa. I called her Cindy before, I remember it. And I think she let me get away with it. That was the problem. Um, so, it, it, everything's come out real nice, friends. I mean, it, there's targets. Obviously, the home, the wires, the corners of the houses, the fruit, the fruit trees. The Not a real garden gnome effect but you know trees nice trees um so it, it come out nice everything come out real nice we're, we're tickled with it uh there was a job i done right here them big stems uh, balsams uh, i forget what it was called but it's on the channel it's it's a good it's a good video friends it is it's fun and that fir tree i was hoping well it's not dead but it doesn't look good it doesn't look good so we'll be back to look at that thing probably and we can send it out in the field that's not a problem we well, i'm sorry that one coming down today i think so lisa <laughs> Thanks. she got me going thanks, yeah lisa's a sweetheart i worked for her lots friends lots right you, you, listen you, you find a good tree guy you, if you find a good tree guy just stick with them just just be loyal if you want to price them out that's right yeah she knows i'm she thinks i'm retiring well i kind of am not no, she won't. She she give you right on me. So here it is. Yeah, we can just fall this thing. Yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll just we'll fall this. I'll put it in here. Uh, what's that? Is my irrigation system? Where's that? Is right under this. Okay, we'll buck this off here right now. See this? Oh yeah, that little cap. Yeah. So the the taps are underneath. Okay, so that's good. That so, to be a, a, safe. Available. Available. So I'll put it here. Do you mind about those little steely whatever that is garbage in the bush there? Okay, good. Okay. Yeah, I can go right down the All right, Sonny, do you want to go? Um, Start flipping that out. It's yeah, and, and grab the uh, the Dalmar, whatever you want. Yeah. I'll go big bore and I'll start kind of juicing this stuff up. So, yeah, that's gonna be nice. That'll be good. So that's it, really, friends. We'll, I, my battery's dying. I'll do a little bit of. Uh, Whatchamacallit there. Um, 
Fucking footage. Be nice to people. Let's, let's be nice to people. Yeah, please.